Morning guys. Thanks for joining me in the kitchen. What is she doing now? You guys are all wondering what is going on. So my Lazy Susan was a cheapo wood one from the second hand store and over time, you guys can't see it, it is so warped that it won't sit flat. Doesn't matter what I do, it will not sit flat. So we're gonna make a new one. And this is how easy it is to do these kinds of things, guys. Source out. Don't go crazy buying these expensive cake spinners. I originally paid $4 for this and I've been using it for probably about six months. That was the bottom, there's a top. So I flipped it over. I've taken the spinning gadget off and we're going to put it on to this 13 by 13 ceramic tile. So I don't have anybody to do blue jobs for me, you guys. I'm on my own. And two part epoxy glue has become my best friend over the years. And you know what? It sticks to everything and it stays stuck. And this two part epoxy is actually from the dollar store. So I'll tell you a funny story about this. The same guy that uh, decided I no longer had value and bailed on me after 10 years always had to buy the most expensive products because you know if it costs more it must be better and I'm like the queen of cheap not because I want to be just because if I want to keep doing fun stuff I have to be cost effective here we go we're gonna just put a generous size gob on it anyway he always bought these really expensive glues from the hardware store and I came home with this stuff from the dollar store one time and he informed me that it was just basically it was garbage and it's not going to work and we're going to stick that right like that and then we're going to do it again. Anyway, it wasn't going to work. It's just cheap garbage store stuff, blah, blah, blah. So I went to stick something for me and I didn't want him sticking it on my oak table. And so I said, how about just throwing that out onto the back porch, use the rail and glue it to the rail or glue it on the rail. And yeah, I just gave you the story. Yes, and he glued it to the rail accidentally. Well, try to get it off the rail. It was quite funny. It was a good lesson learned for him that you don't always have to spend gobs and gobs of cash. So we're just going to do that. And we're going to pop down another tile. So that was a 13 by 13 ceramic tile. And we're going to put a 13 by 13 ceramic tile right over top of this. Actually, that's not true. What The bottom one is a 12 by 12. The top is a 13 by 13. So it's going to overhang a tiny bit, which is fine. Doesn't matter. And I'm going to weight it and we're going to paint on it a little bit later but just so that you can all see, look at that, my friends. Thing of beauty, thing of beauty. And you know what? These ceramic tiles at Lowe's were like $13 a box of 12. So that's pretty cheap and I paint on them and I've utilized quite a few of them for other things. Glue from the dollar store and a $4 Lazy Susan. And so for five bucks, Five minutes of my time and a couple good time minutes to spend with you guys. We have just made a new Lazy Susan. All right, my friends, poor happy, stay safe, source out, look for good deals. You guys can all do this. We can, we can continue to paint and be creative and enjoy what we're doing without breaking the bank. All right, my friends, bye for now.